Yo, 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 what's up, man? It's your boy Zone, and you are hooked on Zone Dot on Kicks. Now, I want to thank all y'all for joining me today. Uh, this this video right here, uh, I'm gonna be doing uh, showing off some of my collection on my jersey wear. And y'all keep uh, tuned to the channel, man. I will be doing my sneaker collection video. You know, as soon as I get you know some 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 more uh, progress on on my production and all that good stuff, so I'll make sure I want to do it perfect when I do do my sneaker collection. It's not the biggest, it's not the hypest, but it's what I like, man. And that's what I'm into, like I said before. Uh, I like to purchase what I like, and I always find the deals. I wait, I patient wait, patience, you know what I'm saying? It'll get you a long ways, especially with these deals. Um, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Uh, the way I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna show you the jersey, and I'm gonna go ahead and throw some kicks on there just because it is zoned out on kicks. And I'm gonna show you what I match my jerseys with, you know, what shoes I like to rock with. And of course, they're all gonna be Jays, cause you know them boys aren't hit me on them Jag things. And um, so I'm gonna get started, man. This is a, a, a pickup that I got a couple of days ago. I did get it on eBay for a good price because the seller had uh, more stuff that I liked on his page. So I, I bundled it up and got this nice Oilers jersey. You know, it's, I love this colorway. And especially I love that it is a starter on the sleeve. That, that's just my favorite part of it. Like you can see this, the starter brand. I love it, man. The star, man, it brings me back. Every time I see starter, man, it brings me back to back in the days. You see everybody with the big old jackets with the starter on the wrist, man. It ain't matter what team it was, man. That shit was flame. Of course, I didn't have it, but, man, they look hella fucking tight on some other people, man. So, uh, I like to match it with these nines, the UNCs. Uh, I did pick these up on eBay as well. I actually got a real good deal on these. I paid $145 plus, like, $10 shipping. Uh, I did, you know, it was it was uh, make your best offer, so I offered them. We went back and forth, and, and we agreed on, on a set price. So this is the Jays I like to rock with that with. You know what I'm saying? The, the nice order started jersey. You know what I'm saying? They were they, they were on top one time at one point in time with, with the whole sports gear. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and move it on to uh, this the other piece that I got with, with the deal with the jer other jersey. It's a nice vintage hockey jersey. I love this maroon, I've, uh, you know, the maroon's been popping lately, and I love the way it has that Nike check on it, with the Nike bag on it, so the, the J's that I put on it, you know what I'm saying, I, I did get these, and I love, I love these, man, I like that off-white, and that burgundy, and that maroon, sorry, that maroon really matches these, so, man, it is a nice, especially when, when it has that check on the front, as well with the shoes. So I know y'all boys get wet every time you see that Nike chick. So go ahead, drip, drip, baby. So well, that's another. I think I, I got both of the jerseys for I think it was 40 bucks. Uh, so I think it was like 30 plus another 10 on the shipping for both jerseys. So uh, so I got a good deal on it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, he worked with me pretty good. So shout out to the plug out there. And um, this is a uh, some some new shit, man. This one I did get for about 100 100 100 and some change, maybe about 120. Uh, the JJ Watt Texans jersey, you already know it's the Nike, the Nike Flame. So th this is, I, I love this piece right here, especially because it, you know what I'm saying. We're on. He's one of the good, the best players right now, going out there in the NFL. And I, and I like to throw in my my 14s, my candy canes. These I've been wearing these for a while, man. These are one of the first shoes that put me on to really be uh, collecting the Jordans. So I, I like to match with this, you know. You know, some, some quick man, something simple. You know, e easy cutters to match, of course. But these, this is what I like. I like to put together right here. So, uh, I love this jersey. Okay, this is my team, as you can tell. You know what I'm saying? Easy Texans. You know what I'm saying? Anything H Town, I'm with, man. So, I'm go ahead and keep it going, man. So now this is we're moving into my Fubu, my my more favorite uh of of my of all my pieces. You know what I'm saying? Uh, some Fubu wear. Bam. You know what I'm saying? What you know about that, man? So, I, man, it's coming back, man. So right now, I'm getting FUBU for cheap. I have not spent over $20 on, on a FUBU jersey. And uh, this one matches real good with my Cigar 7s. You know what I'm saying? I like to throw this on there together. Uh, like I said, I, I I probably wore these one time already. Just because it was, I think, for like Thanksgiving or something. 
but I got this jersey not too long ago. Like I said, man, I think my normal mistaken, it was like 15 and a couple of bucks shipping. So like I said, man, y'all 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 look out for the fubu, man. It's just hot, man. It's a nice colorway, that burgundy. The numbers are patent leather. So I mean, like I said, they're, they're used, but it's all good. I mean, hell, you gonna use it too. And you never know, man, go on pass on the blessings to someone else, man. If you ain't gonna rock it and shock it, man, go on pass it up. You know, go go donate your shit at the Goodwill, man, before I can go get the shit, man. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, it was a good price, man. Nice jersey, nice colorway. Now this one, uh, this is one of my grill pieces. I did find this one at, at the thrift. It's a nice vintage Nike. I don't know what kind of jersey it is. I mean, it is a V-neck. And I love it. every time I, I, I see the uh Busting shots out there or what? I, li I like to see the, the, the orange Nike tag on it, man. It's one of my favorite tags to see. Um, like I said, it was a nice piece. You know, I'm gonna throw these on there with it. Maybe next year I'll probably shock and rock these. The 12s, you know, the Masters. I mean, uh, a lot of y'all want me to do some reviews on this, and I will. I, I will do it shortly, man. So so this this is what I, but I'm rocking with this one right now. So vintage Nike jersey. With the, with the 12s, with the Masters, so, you know what I'm saying, peep it out, man, I think I got this one for like three bucks, you know what I'm saying, I think I went like on a Saturday and everything's like half off, so man, y'all do y'all, y'all do y'all, oh, that, y'all go out there and, and get in them damn stores, man, you be, you be finding some crazy shit, you find a lot of nice jerseys, not even just FUBU or, or, or stuff like that, man, you find some nice champion, some nice champion old school jerseys, you know, I see a lot of those in there, man, and it seems like someone doesn't need it, they'll just could you know, donate and that'd be good quality stuff too, you know. So, you know, it's just on the hunt, man. You gotta be you gotta be on it, man. So there's another another piece I got. I think I did get this one for about eight dollars plus another couple of bucks shipping. You know, this one goes well with the cherries uh, or some all white J's. I do got the cherries up there. You know what I'm saying? This is one of my grill shoes. So I'll match that with this. Like I said. Not too much money on eBay, this one I got, man, so the good stuff all white with, with the red and the, the navy. Now this one was one of my favorite, well, because, uh, you know what I'm saying, you got the FUBU, man, and as you can tell, man, the, the, the fonts do change, so, you know what I'm saying, uh, they do have different fonts on them, it just, you just gotta be on the hunt, you know what I'm saying, it's all official, you do, you do get the FUBU, the FUBU logos and everything, man, it's a, it's a very nice piece, I did get this one for a deal. And I like to match it with this one right here. Look at the, the fours. So it's it's a good it's a good match. I also got the, the Flint 12s. I, li I like to rock it with the Flints. You know what I'm saying? It, it goes real well. I mean, there's other J's you can match it with, man. But I like to rock it with those, man. This one, I like this. I, I love that gray. That wood gray by uh, the 11s. You know what I'm saying? You can jump on those. Now, I'm going to keep it going, man, with some more football heat, man. Bye, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, man, I love this font as well. Like I said, some nice. It's vintage already, man, because you can see it, it's looking a little off-white as well. So I don't know, man, but it's a throw piece, man. I did get this one. I, I believe I got it at uh at the thrift. So good stuff, man. I, I, bam, just to keep it going with the 12s, the UNC. You know, that's that's a good little look right there. Nice little look, man. So you know what I'm saying? I'm into this shit, man. Hey, that's another piece. This is one or another, a, a good piece of mine. I love this one. The long sleeve. And like I just, as you can see, I'm kind of into that colorway as well with that, that baby blue, the North Carolina. So this was a nice cop, man. This is one. I got actually this one dead stock. It had the tags in it and everything. So man, this is this is a nice piece right here, man. Long sleeve. You got the the logo on that thing, man. So it's a nice cop, man. Uh. This is one of my, one of my most, most cherished jerseys, and you know, you're gonna see why, man. So I've been, I have been having this jersey since I was a little teen. I run around, and, uh, and I've been holding on to it, man. I hold it very dearly, cause I, uh, when I had this jersey, man, we were doing a lot of fun stuff as kids, you know, a lot of dumb shit as well. But uh, this is my zone one, you know what I'm saying? What you know, man, I bet none of y'all got this one. So this is a nice man that says zoned out boys. You know what I'm saying? Uh, my music group that we, we had and y'all check out my homies, man, Blow Time Entertainment. You know what I'm saying? 
y'all check out our music. I'll be leaving some uh, description on there so y'all can link up to the website and y'all check out our music, man. Um, so this is my, my most cherished piece right here, man. Zone, man. So with the eight on it, man. For all y'all boys out here, man, from that northeast side of Houston, man. Y'all know what's up. And I will rock these with like either the 11s or, or the 13 breads. You know what I'm saying? Depending on the weather, you know how it is. And we do wear our shoes around here, man. So, you know what I'm saying? We I don't just collect and stack up, man. I, I, I wear them maybe a year later, but I wear them a shit, man. Uh, like I said, I don't like to be rocking the same shoes. Everybody's walking at the same time, so I wait a little time. Even if I have to wait two years, but I will bust them out, man. You know, it's good to have them on ice, man. I, li I like to lick at them sometimes. So, and you know what I'm saying? Pick up some pieces to go with them. And uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and do just a little bonus in there. And if y'all like me doing this kind of stuff, I'll keep it up. But for now, I'm just gonna do this one piece. I did get it shipped. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you see what it is. If y'all like this type of stuff, I, I will be doing it some more. You know what I'm saying? Some first class packaging right here. Can never go no wrong. Uh, so let's see what we got here. Uh, my little man been waiting for me to unbox this, but I've been waiting. So I got this. Uh, that Tony Hawk Pro Skater for the PS1. Uh, we I do be collecting old school video games, especially the Super Nintendo games. And I'm into that type of shit as well. So uh, let's see what it got, man. I, I, I got this for eight bucks. You know what I'm saying? It got booklet and everything. It's just like the, the, the seller said, man. It's, it looks in brand new to be, man. Let's see how that, that how that black disc look though, cause that's where it really is. Oh man, this you can see almost says near death stock right here, man. I don't probably can't give it no justice, but man, but this is hell of a nice little cop, man. So I'm into vintage video games too. So if y'all like those type of shit, man, I'll do some unboxing. And if I find some over there in the wild, the wild me in the flea market and shit like that, when me and my little man go out there and get. It. So with that, uh, if y'all like that type of shit, man, I'll, I'll, I'll do some games as well, some vintage games. Well, not vintage, but classic games, retro games. So y'all let me know down in the description if y'all want me to keep doing on that. And uh, just for upcoming, I'm gonna show you what I got up upcoming just so y'all can uh, keep in tune. I will be doing some work on my Space Jam 11s. Uh, I'll just show you real quick about where I'm at right now with these. I did get these for about 340 plus some shipping. Um, I got them, it's it an honest deal. I mean, it was a pretty good deal. One of the best, but it's pretty good for the 340 plus shipping. Uh, man, they're in pretty good condition. And uh, the pant leather is beautiful on it. I did separate them myself because I did start icing up the bottoms. I got some tape on it, some painter's tape on it right now because I am doing some sessions on it. Uh, I'll probably should drop some pictures of before and after. But I'll leave that to when the show, when that episode airs, you see it, man. Now y'all keep it tuned, man. I will be doing the re glue. I'll show you some step by step how to do it, how I do it. Of course, there's many ways to do it. There's different products you can use. You know what I'm saying? Got the carbon fiber paper in there and everything. And I do use these sneaker shields, man. If you don't want to get your shit creased up, man, I highly suggest you jump on this shit. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you go on on their website and you find some good deals, man. So some sneaker shields, shout out, man. Like I said, man, y'all keep in tune. I appreciate y'all, man. Y'all make sure y'all comment down, comment down below. And y'all check me out, man. This is Zone. This is Zoned Out on Kicks. One time for your mind, let a player come through. Uh.